What is going on miners and welcome back to the Hobbyist Miner channel. Well, today we're gonna to go ahead and talk a little bit about our 13 GPU rig. Um, those of you guys not familiar, we are running 11 RX 470s. We're running one RX 570, all four gig cards. And then we have a lonely RX 580, eight gig card here. So about a week ago, we did a video on um, using the Polaris um, BIOS editor. And it was the first time I'd actually used it. And uh, we did some testing on it and we did, I think one or two cards. And it actually ended up working out pretty fruitful by the time we were done. So I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a recap a week later of upgrading all of these cards and what the differences was from last week versus now a week later after we've done all of the cards and the total hash rate gained from just going ahead and doing the one-click Polaris editor that anybody can do. It's very simple, very easy. I'll put a link in the upper right-hand corner of a full guide on how to use the Polaris BIOS editor uh, to adjust some items. It's a one-click feature, guys, and it bumps up some of your timings and things like that in order to maximize your card for the full potential for mining. So let's go ahead and jump over to the computer and let's discuss our results. Okay guys, so about a week ago actually, we did this video here, how to increase your mining hash rate with the Polaris BIOS editor. We can go ahead, let's up our quality here, it's at 480. We can go ahead and see what our cards were, during, were doing. So I'm gonna ignore the 580 at the top um, and I'm really only going to focus on the Ravencoin, on uh, the RX 470, and the and the 570s. Uh, I did make changes to the 580 though with the Polaris uh, BIOS editor, so I did all the cards. But I'd, I'd like to focus more on the overall gains for all of the RX 470 and 570s for mining Ravencoin today. So uh, most of these that you can see here, we have 11.8, 11.3, 8.3, uh, 13. Um, 0.07, 11.8, so mostly 11.8, and then a few 13.10s in here, uh, a little bit all over the place. Um, so if we go ahead and calculate that out, um, let's see here. So let's go ahead and do 11.83 plus 11.83 plus 13.07 plus 11.80 plus 13.48, plus 11.80, plus 12.93, plus 11.89, plus 13.10, plus 13.10, plus 11.83, plus 13.30. Okay, so, sorry about that. Um, we are at 149.96. And, and so we're gonna go ahead and make a note off screen here. 149.96 was our before, okay? So that gives us an idea. So let's go ahead and load up HiveOS as of right now. We'll go ahead and refresh this rig. And uh, right now we are at 154.9 uh, for Kapow. But I'm gonna refresh this because I swear like five minutes ago we were at 164.9. But that's fine. Let's go ahead and review some of our numbers here. So we don't have any 11s in here now. Um, we are all high 12.8 um, before I started recording this. And we'll refresh before we're done. We were at like 13.6 plus across the board with the 570 giving us 14 plus. Um, so definitely some great results. I mean, without a doubt, if, if we just look at this and we say it's, it's one mega hash of gain across 12 cards, so 12 mega hash total, that's a whole nother card that we've quote unquote gained from just going ahead and using the Polaris BIOS editor, which is a huge home run uh, in that regard. So let me go ahead and refresh this and we'll see where we are in just a minute. Aha, uh -huh. <laughs> you can't call me a liar, I swear. Okay, so if you take a look, guys, uh, we are at 163 here. We got up to 168. Uh, here as well, 164 registered there. So let's go back to Hive OS and refresh here. There we go, 168.4, perfect. So I'm gonna record that as our after number, 168.4, zero. So if we do our math there, um, we will do 168.40 minus 149.96. 
So here's our difference. 168.4 minus 149.96. Now, I, I know hash rate fluctuates, especially Ravencoin, but 18.44 ha mega hash difference between using Polaris BIOS editor single click and not using it. That's a home run, guys. That's a card. That's a card plus some. Like our cards traditionally right now, like what are we 13, 9, 6, let's say 13, 9, yeah, 9, 8, let's say minus 13.98. So that's a full card plus 4.46 mega hash. That's insane. That's insane. So if you guys do want to check out the video guide that I put together on the Polaris BIOS editor, um, I'll put a link in the upper right hand corner. I'll also put a link down below. But I wanted to give you guys a quick update on that. Last time we met, we we only did card one and card two in this listing. And I wanted to go ahead and do it for all of my cards and then give it a week or so and see what type of stability we had and hash rate we had and how things were going. And I've been super happy with it. Well, if you guys enjoyed this short video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Take care.